know, thousands of people are now hooking up their home computers through high-speed cable. But in Dollars and Deals, we're going to show you how you might just be making life easy for hackers. All the details coming up on Eyewitness News. Live, local, late breaking. You're watching Channel 10 Eyewitness News. Thousands of local computer users are disconnecting their modems for something much faster. Cable TV hookups speed up web surfing. But in tonight's Dollars and Deals, Mark Schumacher shows us how this need for speed could be playing right into the hands of hackers. If you have a standard phone modem hookup to your computer, then you're the only one on that particular connection. However, with these high-speed cable hookups, you're basically on a highway with dozens of other people in your area, and if you aren't careful, they could have easy access to your computer files. The dig has been on for months. South Florida is being wired for high-speed internet access through fiber optic cable, now, however, some concerns have been unearthed. It's basically like leaving your front door unlocked in the office at night. Paul Zimmerman, a computer engineer, says these new cable connections are great and can be safe, but many of our computers are set up in such a way that we're inviting hackers right into our home. What I'm seeing on the screen here is actually what's on the drive of another computer. Here's how it can happen. Using common programs for finding internet addresses, Zimmerman looks one up and then links up. If the other person has not disabled file sharing on their computer... Ahead of time, I created a little icon called I Hacked Your PC. Then Zimmerman can do anything. Here, he just transfers a computer icon. There's no icon there. When I pull this over, I'm going to copy it right to it through the internet. And there it is. I want to point out that Zimmerman does not hack into other people's computers. For this demonstration, he hacked into another computer in his house that uses a separate internet link. I have as much access. I could print to their printers, I can share files, I could delete files. So you can see why this is a common way that hackers are stealing your personal information. But there is good news. The fix is easy if you know where to look. And we're going to go into network settings. If you click on My Computer, then Network Settings, then the TCP IP Adapter... We're going to select Properties, and then we're going to select Bindings. Then when you see File and Printer Sharing, you turn it off. Another good safety measure is to use passwords to get into your computer. There is also a website you can go to for help. Paul Zimmerman has his own free site that will show you everything you need to ensure that you are protected. So if you log on to WPLG.com, click on Dollars and Deals, we will take you there. And that is Dollars and Deals. I'm Mark Schumacher, Channel 10 Eyewitness News. In Dollars and Deals, we have a warning about those high-speed cable connections a lot of people are now using to link their computers to. You may actually be inviting hackers right into your own home. That story is next.